I'm Anil Kumar sharing with you one of the first questions which you'll come across when you get started with calculus. In calculus, finding slope of tangent line is always of our prime importance. So let's begin by finding slope of a straight line first. So it's kind of a review for you. So here we do have a straight line. This straight line passes through two points. One of them is minus 4 x-intercept y-intercept is 2. Now you're supposed to find slope of this line, right? Now here we also have a circle and on the circle I've drawn a tangent which passes through point P. P happens to be on the circle with radius of 5 units, right? Now the question for you is to find slope of this tangent line which goes through point P. So you can now pause the video, find slope for both these lines. So the first line is a straight line. It's not a tangent, just a straight line. It's kind of a review for you. So you can actually pause the video, answer the question, and then look into my suggestion. Once we find slope of these two lines, one of them is a straight line going through x-intercept of minus 4, y-intercept of 2. The other one is tangent to a circle with radius of 5 center at origin going through the point 3, 4. Okay, now let's find out slope of the given line AB. Slope of line AB could be found by checking the difference between y and x, right? So delta y over delta x, this ratio gives us the slope. Now y2 minus y1, we say if I consider the point B, the coordinates are 0, 2, and for point A, the coordinates are minus 4, 0, right? So the difference in y values is 2 minus 0, and the difference in x values is 0 minus minus 4. That gives us 2 over 4, or it gives us a slope of half, correct? So that is the slope for the given line A, B. Now, you would have always found using this particular triangle also, rise is 2 and run is 4. Positive slope since the line is rising, correct? So that's simple. So that is how you find slope of a line. Now the question for you is, how do you find slope of this line which is tangent to the circle at P, 3, 4, with center at 0. Now here, we have only one point into consideration. And how do you find slope when only one point is given to you? Think about it. Well, here we can adopt a strategy. If I join O with P, then since OP is radius, and we are given a tangent, these two are at right angles. So the strategy here is find slope of the line OP, right? So OP, we are given effectively two points. Origin is at 0, 0. So slope OP will be 4 minus 0, right? Divided by 3 minus 0. Is that okay? 3 minus 0. And that gives you... 4 over 3, correct? 4 over 3. So slope of this line OP is 4 over 3. Let me call this line L1 as the tangent line. What is the slope of line L1? Slope of line L1 will be negative reciprocal of 4, 3 or minus 3 over 4. Correct. So from this property of perpendicular lines, since these two lines are perpendicular lines, we could easily find slope of tangent. Is that okay? So that was the strategy applied. I hope you understand and appreciate this strategy of finding slope of a tangent to a circle. Now the question is, if we are given some other curve and we have to find slope of tangent line, for example, 
if I'm given a curve which is let's say a parabola right and you need to find slope of a line which is tangent at a point then how are you going to find it now in a circle you applied one strategy got the solution what are you going to do here so this is the function f of x and you need to find slope of the line L2 which is tangent to the curve f of x at a point P. Now that becomes extremely difficult. In calculus, we'll try to solve such questions. Now the curves could be different kinds, right? So it could be a curve like this where you need to find tangent at any point, right? So, so kind of like this. How will you find tangent at any point on the curve is what we are going to discuss in calculus. So go through the next video to understand the concept and see how using calculus or the concepts of calculus we can find slope of tangent to any curve. That's the beauty of calculus. I hope you appreciate it. I'm Anil Kumar. You can subscribe to my videos and learn a lot. Thank you and all the best.